Well, new at 11 tonight, the countdown on Clematis has been going on now for more than five hours already. But people are just now gearing up for the big finish as we say goodbye to 2013 and hello to 2014. Can you believe it? News yeah. Channel 5's Christina Noche live in the middle of all of it. Christina. Right now we're at Roxy's rooftop on Clematis Street. A lot of people out here getting ready to celebrate with less than an hour to the new year. Now this year a lot of restaurants and bars along Clematis really got together to give people a lot of dip different options so they would come here and spend their new years from black tie to beads to masquerade themed parties. Whether 2013 was good, bad, or somewhere in between, it's a night to celebrate. Oh, yeah, for sure. <laughs> the party started early at the City Place stage. People lined up for live entertainment and a last chance snowfall. Many businesses along downtown Clematis came together offering drink specials, even concerts at their venues, calling it the Clematis Countdown. Ending 2013. We're starting with we all just graduated, so we're excited. Starting our real life. Is anything you want to do differently? Not to be afraid and always go on a whim and then do what I want. And over at the Mar-a-Lago Club on Palm Beach was a black tie New Year's event for the who's who in showbiz sports and everything Hollywood. For the new year, any resolutions, anything you'd like to do a little differently 2014? I think this year I've resolved to wear the mantle of greatness with more poise. Other guests included Paul McCartney and Rod Stewart. Donald Trump says the best place to start 2014 is the Palm Beach area. Well, it's just a very special area. Great people and very philanthropic people like Mr. Kraft, and it's just great. Now, right on the dot at midnight, right down this street on Flagner at the waterfront, that's going to be where the fireworks are going to be. A really nice show, about 23 minutes, so that's where you'll want to be for that. Now, I asked around town, the big thing for New Year's is champagne. On Clematis Street, the most expensive bottle of champagne was about 1400 A little ways on Palm Beach Island, they say the most expensive bottle there, $2,500 for tonight on New Year's Eve. For now, we're live in downtown West Palm Beach. Christina Noche, WPTV News Channel 5.